Hey guys, I have a new um, AliExpress haul. This is the second part of my order that I had made last month sometime. Um, so let's get see what we got. I went ahead and just to save time, I already opened everything. Just because the last video I learned. Okay, this is the only thing that came in that was a little damaged. It um, was bent like that. But I don't know. Um, I don't think it was AliExpress people. I think it was my mailman because he had left it in the mailbox kind of wonky. So I can't blame anybody for that. But um, it'll still work. I just have to put some painter's tape and hold it down a little bit. And it'll work its way out. But I just love this picture. Oh, it's backwards. Oh, you could do it either way, but the words are backwards. I love the saying. This is beautiful. And it was under a dollar. Okay, I have some bigger stamps again. Um, these are all vintagey looking. Let me get a piece of white paper. Hold on. Yes, I have this stamp, but in a regular big wooden block one. And that's one of my favorites, so. Um, this one has the Mona Lisa on it. And when I first saw this, I thought it was a globe. <laughs> but it's actually a cat face, so that's even better. And you get the Mona Lisa, and you got a quote. All, right. All of these were really cheap too, like $1.50, $1.53. Here's another vintage one. The vintage ladies, the vintage umbrella. They're like an ad. Newspaper ads. Another one of my vintage ladies. Uh oh, that's too old. This is like a vintage um, sewing pin where you put your pins at. Rings, hair pins, safety pins. She's sewing. Scissors, thread. Really, really cute. I got some fairies. I got this more, um, not really for art German. I got this one for my um, Jane Davenport uh, journal that I have. Well, I guess it is journaling. My Jane Davenport um, journal that I'm working on. And I got this one because I just thought it was so stinking cute. I love the light bulbs. But they have different sayings on them for different um, holidays. This one has got a, a Christmas tree. And then you can put the merry and bright. You light up my life. Sorry you're feeling burned out. <laughs> um, but they're all individual, so you can use them separately. Um, love you, Watts and Watts. Thanks a lot. <laughs> and then this one's got a, a heart. If you can see it, it's got a heart on it. And it says, I think you are brilliant. So yeah, these are really, really cute. It's nice and big. And this was a uh, under two dollars, I know for sure. All right, the next thing I got is a tin, and this was like sixty or seventy cents, like crazy cheap. And you get the cute little tin, and all your little stickers come out. And these are mostly planner stickers. They're really cute. You get a ton of stickers for that price. And it's just this um, cute little girl. You can't tell what she's saying because it's, you know, it's in another language. But you can kind of tell, you know, when she's mad. You can tell when she's happy, when she's eating, when she's angry. Very, very cute stickers. And it looks like they're all different. You get a ton of them for that price. And cute little case. Alright, this next thing was three cents. Three cents. Not kidding. I bought four of them, but I already gave them away. This one's mine. Um, nice, cute little hardcover book. It says episode diary on it. It's it's random where you, you, you hit select. You um, they just send you whichever ones, you know, random out the four. So I actually did get one of each, so um, three cents I gave them to my friends. I love them. Sticky pad, sticky pad, a uh, little pen here. The pen actually works really good too. 
and then you put it back in, save your little pen, um, and then for little magazines or your little book um, bookmarkers. I just love it. I think it's really cute. Candy, put it in your purse. You always got a notepad on the go. And nobody sent these to me. I paid for all of this stuff myself. I think that's all of the big ones. Halloween's coming up, so I thought I would buy some wooden stamps. This one is a little hand print, a little, not a hand print, it's bones of a hand. And they come in this little cardboard box. These were cheap too. These were all under a dollar. I want to say they were 60 something cents each. Um, I haven't played with them yet, but I will do a video on all my, um, to, to test all of these out. They look really good quality. It's funny because the wooden ones are often cheaper than the clear ones. So we got a um, skeleton hand. And I have the skeleton body. And then this one's not Halloween. This one is just a random, looks like a... Um, an ad, like a newspaper ad with a gentleman on it. If you can see all of those. Maybe not. There you go. Cheap, really cute. I love them. And you can also keep the boxes, cut the pieces out, um, the images if you want it to, and the um, different language on the back and put those in your journal. I keep all that kind of stuff. Alright, what's next? I have a few smaller stamps and then I got some washi. Alright, the first one is a smaller Mona Lisa with the Eiffel Tower in the back. And this one, I absolutely love, love, love this stamp. Hard to focus. Isn't it beautiful? It's a nice size too. I really like her. I'm going to practice and try her later and see how she stands. And then this one is um, it's all coffee related items. This is like a coffee stain, coffee stain. This one says coffee helps. You can do it. Warmest greetings. I love you more than my first cup of coffee. May your coffee be strong and your day be sweet. And this one says life happens. And these are just spilled cups of coffee. Under a dollar, y'all. Not even kidding. A buck. Oh. Um, I got these little cute little unicorn post-its. I'm going to bring these to work and keep these on my desk. And then I got some washi. I got these washies because they were um, very different than most washies. Um, and I thought they were very unique. I wanted to try them for art journaling. Let's just find a page and stick some down. Let's do it right here. Mm, well, others aren't in here. Good. Let's get a little closer. All right. We've got this really cool one. Let's take some off. Alright, 
goes all the way to here before it starts um, the pattern over again. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven girls, and they all have a different saying there, all have different clothes. It's just really, it fits in good with my journaling style. These were cheap too, under a dollar. I want to say these were like 50, 60 cents. This is what it looks like. Alright, let's see. These look like some celebrities, actually. Alright, and it stops here at Madonna. Definitely Elizabeth Taylor, Princess Diana, Hitchcock, Michael Jackson, uh, Laurel, uh, Charlie Chaplin, Madonna. I'm not sure who that one is. That's Burt Reynolds, and that looks like Chardé. But they have different pieces, like she's got the Little Mermaid eyes. <laughs> Madonna's got the um, Cinderella princess eyes. That is way cool. I really like that. See if you can see that up close a little bit. Isn't that neat? Alright, let's do the next one. Right, two more left. It's about time to go get some coffee, is what I'm thinking. Sometimes it's just so hard to find the edge to get started. This one. Goes to here. It's all paper piece, mixed media, all of them. And, but these have the days on them. I guess one says Tuesday, Monday, Sunday. It's got the days of the week if you want to cut them individually and put them on a, a planner or a calendar or something. Got one more. I hate when it rips like that. Let me do that again. Alright. Ah, oh, this paper sucks. There's like, um, it's like indented. So every time I pull it off, it rips. But I love it. It's so freaking cool, the paper itself. I like the color and everything. Alright, let's see. See where the new one begins. Uh oh. I went too far. This one has the color of masking tape for sure. Go up a little bit. Here we go. Okay, there we start. If you ever do mess up, don't throw it away. Put it in your book. It adds texture. Paint over it, gesso over it, whatever you gotta do. Put some more collage pieces down. I am really liking this freaking tape. Still trying to open this last one. Exacto knife back. Oh, these are all um, different old movie posters. I see one for Titanic. There's Audrey Hepburn on one of the, or well, several of these. Singing in the Rain. There's Meryl Monroe. Let's 
the last one. Okay, these, this line is really cool. It's different movies. It looks like they're a movie poster. Like Titanic, Tiffany's, Breakfast at Tiffany's, um, Funny Face, Gigi, Seven Year Itch, A Dog's Life. This is Wizard of Oz. What is this one? On the Town. I love these. Aren't they cool? See if you can see those last ones. I'm gonna have to go back and see if they had any more designs. Find what store this was at. Okay, guys, if y'all have any more questions or um, anything about the stuff that I got at AliExpress, let me know. Put it down at the bottom, and I would really appreciate it if you hit that sub button if you haven't already. Um, thumbs up, and make sure you hit that bell so you'll get notifications every time I um, have a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.